Christmas is boom time for the shops and it's also boom time for the credit card companies because, well let's face it, many of us will buy at least some of our presents using this. Maybe actually I'll, I'll use this one. Oh no, that's maxed out, I'm going to use this one instead. Or I could ditch the pocket of cards and use just one of these instead. It's bizarrely a card called Coin, a new kind of payment system that stores all of your plastic cards in one. This is a business lunch, so I'm going to expense it on the business card. I just tap this button to select the right card, and that's it. Your current cards can be registered onto Coin's service by using the accompanying card scanner to pull the details into its app. But isn't this essentially cloning a credit card? And what's to stop someone else from pinching your card and cloning it? Well, that's the question I put to Coin's founder when I spoke to him online. We made every user verify their information when they enter their cards into the system. What that does is it doesn't allow anyone else to take your information using Coin. It's actually better locked down uh, in the US than um, a traditional piece of plastic. Have the banks actually given you their blessing to do this? Actually, you know, like any new technology when it comes out, it's somewhat in a gray area. So the rules haven't, haven't been written for something like coin. So those conversations will now occur um, early to mid next year, to make sure that the partnerships are solid. In fact, coin has several security features. If, for example, the card moves out of range of your Bluetooth smartphone, it deactivates and sounds an alarm on your handset. When the coin is out of your range, meaning it's out of your reach, and someone decides to skim, skim your information, a coin will have a skim alarm. Basically what it'll do is, if it detects fraudulent activity, it'll tell you. It can't prevent the swipe, but it can definitely detect the swipe. Okay. Oh, final question. Why didn't you call it card? It's a card, not a coin. <laughs> it, you know, I like the name coin because coins have been around for ages, and to me they rep represent simplicity. And that was the whole goal of the company, is to simplify our users' lives. All right, Kanesh, thanks for talking to us.